for ceramics today. You guys, uh, well, I'm not here. I'm, you know, around. Uh, if you have any questions, by all means, shoot me an email. I'm happy to respond to that uh, or post a comment to the video and I'll, and I'll get back with you guys. All right, so for today, for while I'm out, you guys are starting the next section of the series is your coil vases. Now the coil vases, remember, 10 inches high. <laughs> nice tall vases, we've got three to choose from. As we play for three vase Monty. All right, so for your coil vases, I want you guys to come up with the designs in your sketchbook first. So sketchbook activity for this week is to work on a coil vase design. Now, when you're designing these, let's not make these as simplistic as these. Please check out the examples. Now, after looking at those examples, what I want you guys to do is see how the different, see those differences in the variety of textures that you're adding to your coil clay. So we got some texture design, we have some sculpture design. We're, we're trying to create something that is beautiful yet functional. I do want to have a functionality aspect to these pieces. Now, 10 inches high is the minimum requirements. You guys want to take this up a little higher? Fine, by, by all means. In your sketchbooks, also think about what are your glazing applications? What kind of colors do you want to put into the, do you want to address on the outside of the pieces? And as always, when we've talked in the past about the textures on the outside of the vase, the coils and everything, if you want to smooth out some of those coils to where you just have the pinwheel design or you have a little bit of the coil uh, shown and then you have some other designs to it, we have the, uh, the stamp pads if you want to create a stamp texture and then pop that on there to have some additional uh, design elements on the outside, by all means do that. I want these things to look good. That's the key. Uh, good quality work always make, always uh, is better than doing a piece just to get a grade. Uh, make some good pieces. I look forward to seeing you guys a sketch and I look forward to seeing you guys, what you guys built. And then uh, as always, I'll see you guys next class. Later guys.